It is 7.19 a.m. 7.20 a.m. We've got these frying pans. We're gonna cook a burger. Get the burger out of the freezer. This will do. Okay, so we get some olive oil for some grease. This is probably too expensive to use on a regular basis, but I just use it because I don't cook burgers that often. And uh, turn on the heat. And we got this burger. Can I see what it looks like? Yes, yeah, so that that's cooking there. And then we have these buns, burger buns. Maybe a bit more heat, I don't know. So we have to cut these buns because they don't come apart naturally. Let's see here. So here we are cutting the bun. There, now, now we have two sides of the bun. And um, the burger begins to sizzle. Now I've got a plate. Put the bun on the plate. Can you see this? See that? Here. There, there, like that. Cooking a burger. And, uh, let's see what we have in the way. We have some ketchup. It's a tasty burger. We have Dijon mustard. And this kind of knife is good for scooping. So this is what is going to be with the burger. And, um, we have some Tostitos with a, ba uh, a bag clip, but I'm not going to need any Tostitos. Olive oil. Now put that away.
Hop. Have some cheese. Let the cheese go on the paper. I found the clip for this to go on there. And we have some vitamins. Okay, well, here's a list of what it has. And you're supposed to eat vitamins with food. And this is food. This is vitamin. So I'll, after I eat the food, I will have the vitamin. And I think it's done. So now we have our tripod and we make it go up and make it go up. Ow. Make it go. Go up. How the trot pot works, and then you can go like that. So we have some apple juice, and we have the burger, which I will now eat. A little undercooked, actually. But it's good. The Dijon mustard makes my nose itch.
This is the vitamin. This is the juice. The juice has 200% vitamin C. So, we're good for that. Fare thee well.